Alright, this is going to be a tutorial on how to install Kali Linux in VMware Workstation. Uh, some of you have been asking me how to, how to perform this task. And uh, I've read that some of you are actually installing it as if we're installing it on a physical hard drive. Um, I'm going to walk you through the VMware image that, uh, that they make. So it's easy, all we have to do is download that file and open it and we have Kali Linux up and running as you can see kinda like this uh, and there is no install process we get to skip that whole step so our first step would be to open up a browser and we want to go to Kali.org once we're there we're gonna click download and then go to custom Kali images and you'll see here there's a ton of images that they have for you know your Samsung Galaxy Note uh, Raspberry Pi and uh, and all their sorts of uh, hardware that they support. But we're going to go here to Kali Linux. So you pick uh, either 64-bit if computer supports it in a virtual machine or 32-bit. So we can click Direct Download, click OK, and we'll just save it to our desktop. All right, so we'll go ahead and we'll uh, we'll let that file download. Alright, now that our file is done downloading, we can go ahead and close our browser and minimize VMware Workstation. And as you can see here, here's the file that we downloaded off the website. We can go ahead and double click the file and extract the data from it. We'll then click unzip and wait for the file to extract. Okay, now that that's done, we can close this window. And you see here we have the file with the extracted data. So, right here. So this is our, our VMware that we're just going to be opening up uh, the file, and it's just going to run. We don't need to install. So we can go ahead and close that. Open up VMware. Again, we can click the Home tab. And instead of clicking create a new virtual machine we're gonna open a virtual machine we're gonna go to our desktop we're gonna click the file that we extracted our operating system to and then we're gonna select this file here Kali Linux 1.1.0 we'll double click it's created a new window for us and then over here on the left hand side we can click power on this virtual machine just say I I copied it and Kali Linux is going to boot up just as if you had in installed it to the hard drive the long way so this is a lot easier and a lot quicker method for uh, if you're unfamiliar and how to install Linux to the hard drive with all the options and and so on we can just extract the file that we downloaded and click open so I'll let Kali boot up for a second alright so we're here at the login screen so we'll click and then our, our username is root and the password is tour, which is root backwards. So T O O R. We'll hit enter. And it will load up the uh, the operating system. And as you can see, now we can fully run Kali Linux. And that was uh, quick and easy. If you like the videos on my channel, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.